Hey, thanks for checking out the Sonic Solutions tutorial. This is hopefully going to help you get uh, all your sound packs from me installed as they're all pretty much uh, built the same way and will install the same way. So let's get started. Let's do the uh, Twin Otter uh, sound pack as an example. And what we're going to do is we're going to cover this in three parts. There will be the installation to your desktop, moving the files over into your game, and then also uh, having all your alias uh, and other sounds set up so that you don't have to copy all the sounds all over the place. You can just create some aliases. So here we go. So let's get your serial number ready and then we're just going to proceed with the installation right here. And the first page will bring you to the um, install sh notes on uh, latest changes to the version as well as detailed uh, information on how to get this installed into your game. Scrolling through will bring you next to the uh, license agreement. If you agree, hit yes and enter your serial number that you would have got from the website you purchased the sound pack from. Clicking through will bring you to this next uh, part which was going to prompt you to uh, install this on your computer. Hit change and hit desktop. This is going to install the uh, sound pack right on your desktop. Hit next. Next all the way through this installing fantastic sounds now and there we go installation successful uh, next screen is going to bring you to a, a, a little link that will bring you to my support site should you need more help or if you're having problems with the uh, install and there's our new uh, zip file that we installed under the desktop the Sonic Solutions sound pack so what we're going to do now is open that sucker up and start moving it into the aircraft that we want. And to make things easier, I'm just going to uh, extract the uh, whole zip file onto the desktop so that I can grab all the folders that I need. And there's a new folder. Once that's open, you'll see the sound folder, sound AI folder. There's a PDF of the install as well as another sound file that you'll need for your other sound AI. All right, let's get everything moved over. So now what we've got is we've opened up another folder with Microsoft Games Flight Simulator X Sim Objects Airplanes. That's the path. And what we want to do is we want to look for the Twin Otter 300 for our example. That's where all the bass sounds are. We're going to take that and rename it. Uh, you can hit F2 and just put in underscore BU for backup is what I do. I do that to the sound folder and to the sound AI folder if there is one existing. Sometimes they don't exist. Um, I always have a sound uh, AI folder for multiplayer which we'll explain later. Back over to our zip folder we're going to take our sound and sa sound AI folders and copy them over to the SimObjects Airplane slash uh, Aerosoft 300, Twin Otter uh, 300. Then there's basically our new sounds are put in there right now with the old sounds all backed up. Anti-aliasing is important so that it keeps the file size down and what it's essentially doing is pointing to play the sounds from another folder. So what we're going to do is we're going to install uh, the aliasing into another Aerosoft Twin Otter sound pointing back to the 300 model. So what we're going to do is we're going to backtrack one folder and install this in the float version. So I already have a sound I a folder here. I'm going to back that up by renaming it underscore backup. And now I'm going to open the sound folder and drag over the sound file from the zip folder. And that's the alias uh, sound config. I'm going to replace the existing one that's in there now. Back out and copy over the sound AI folder so that will have our new sounds for multiplayer and outside of views and other players as well as our new sound config that's in the existing sound folder replaced which is pointing back to the 300 there's all of our sounds in there so basically all these sounds are playing and uh, any other model that's alias to it is uh, simply calling and looking for these sounds and playing for it. And that's pretty much it for the install. Now you have all your sounds installed complete with uh, Sound AI and uh, you should be good to go. And should you have any problems, do not hesitate to uh, get hold of me for help at sonicsolutions.info support. 
fill out a help ticket. Make sure you throw your phone number down so that I can call you if I need to. Uh, sometimes it's a little faster for you if I give you a quick call and run you through it and help you out with any problems other than spending days exchanging emails and tickets. Anyway, thanks for watching and uh, hope this helps out. See you later.